Hi developers, welcome back to Code Step by Step. My name is Anil, and uh, with this video, we are going to start a new series on Laravel 9. So let's start with a question: that why should you watch this series? As we know, there are lots of courses are available on Laravel on internet, but they are actually not completed. So here we will cover all topics of Laravel with example. All topics means we are not going to miss even a single topic about uh, laravel in that course and all topics are available with the example i will tell you how you can use this example in the project also right and everything is covered step by step first of all i will tell you how we can install the things and create a setup for uh, laravel then we will go through with the basics uh, and intermediate database advanced apis with the project we will do each and everything step by step and uh, as I told you, I will give you the exact example like uh, where we can use these topics in real project so that whenever you will get a situation in the real projects, you can use these topics. Every topic is covered with the interview questions so that you can automatically prepare with for interviews also and uh, every feature are explained uh, with complete detail. There is a note like that uh, we will just cover the basics about these features and we are not going to in a deep dive so here we will take a deep dive with the every feature if you have any kind of query related to the that specific topic you can ask me in the comment box with the timeline so that i can just check that uh, your point and i can give you the answer code is also available on the github and if you want to follow me you can follow me on the instagram link is given he, uh, given here so now question is what is laravel laravel is basically a php framework i know that you are aware about it but if you are not if you are a really beginner then don't worry as i told you we will go step by step this is basically a php framework now you may have a question that what is framework i will cover that in the next week next slide actually but let's take on the look on the laravel so this is a php framework uh, used for develop uh, web applications and api and now you may have a question that why we cannot make web APIs uh, and web applications uh, directly in the PHP? Why why we need a framework? See, framework basically provide to provide the ready-made functionalities and features so that we can make our application really fast with the minimum time, right? And Laravel is basically use the MVC pattern. That means model view controller. What is that? I will give you. Uh, complete tutorial about it in the separate video that will be available in the complete series right and uh, laravel is really easy to use and easy to learn also and this is the most used and most popular framework of php right uh, i guess uh, let's say if we are making uh, 100 websites in frameworks in uh, php then maybe 50 to 60 are made in laravel only all right so now the question is what is framework see framework is basically a programming uh, tool right that is basically provide a ready-made functionalities feature for fast development and there are lots of chances that if you use framework then your code will be well managed and error free also right with the minimum errors so what kind of feature they provide there is a long list but i can give you a brief idea like uh, when we are making a project we have to must set up the uh, we must have to set up the routing and uh, database connection and we have to manage the code and we have to make some uh, functions or helper functions for sessions and validations and all all these kind of features are already available in the frameworks not only in the laravel also they are available in the other framework also but laravel actually provide the more features more functionality and this is a really uh, popular right and is easy, easy to learn that's why we use it now let's talk about the history and version of laravel current version of laravel is 9 as i told you and this is mentioned in this video complete video also and first release is done in 2011 and uh, uh, which is as, as I told you this is written in the PHP this is a most advanced framework which is used with the composer and command line what is composer what is command line I will tell you in the upcoming videos and uh, initially it was started with the 
Taylor Otwell, but now they have complete team and this is open source also. So anyone can contribute uh, in this uh, Laravel framework. So why we use Laravel? I already told you the many features that, but still let's take a look. Laravel actually have the large community on the internet. That means there are lots of avail, uh, developers on the Laravel so that if you are looking to any question related to the Laravel, then you can easily find on the internet, like on the Stack Overflow, on the Git. Answer are easily available. This is really fast and simple and they provide regular updates. Uh, before this version, they actually provide the updates in every six months. Now they are providing the uh, updates in um, every one year. And that is actually a major update. But if you want to check the minor updates and bug fixing, they will do uh, weekly and monthly also. And the command line of Laravel is really awesome. You can create your components, models, controller with the single command. And this is actually the great thing that I actually like about Laravel. Okay, so now uh, let's see that. What is the difference between Laravel, React and Angular? Because we know that Laravel is also used for web apps, React, Angular, Vue also used for web apps. So what is the basic difference in them? And this kind of questions can also ask in the interview. See, Laravel is a server side framework. Now you may have questioned that what is server side framework? The any framework or any programming language that execute on the server side is basically a server side framework like Angular and React. They are client side uh, framework and library. Why? Because they actually execute on the browser. If anything is uh, run on or execute on the server, that is server side uh, programming language or framework. PHP is a server side programming language. That's why Laravel also a server side uh, running framework. So we cannot make a single page application in the Laravel. This we have to just uh, uh, confess that because in any server side framework or in any server side language, we cannot make single page application. What is that? I will tell you, but it have lots of other advantage over the React and Angular. It can connect with the database, Angular, React, Vue or any uh, JavaScript library or framework cannot connect with the database. I'm not talking about the node, that's, that is a complete different thing, right? And uh, so how actually Angular and uh, React made a project? They need APIs to connect with the database. And how we can make these APIs with Laravel or any other server side framework? So basically, Laravel is basically used on to create the, you can say that web applications that directly connect with the database, that directly connect with the database or APIs and Angular are basically used to make single page application. They cannot connect with database. If they want to connect database, we have to use APIs for them, right? And uh, let me just give you the example of uh, what I said, server side rendering. So just let me put here react.js. I want to open two website, react.js.org and Laravel. So first i will give you the example of a uh, single page application so if i'm jumping on from one menu to the another menu our browser is actually not refreshing our web website that is single page application it look like that our complete website is worked on a single page and um, what is not single page so if i'm clicking on any <clears throat> uh, link it will completely reload our uh, website with the browser that is not actually a single page application so this can also also be asked in the interviews so now let's take a look on the major topic that we will cover there's a lots of other topics also but this is actually a glance of uh, major topics like uh, first i will tell you what is laravel uh, in this video we are talking about that after that uh, we will discuss what is framework in a separate video composer how we can install php uh, Composer, Laravel, what is MVC, basics, controller, routing, model, view, and uh, lots of other things, sessions, inputs, uh, and forms, blade template, database migrations, APIs, lots of stu stuff. I cannot uh, talk about each and everything, but uh, these all things are major, and rather than it, we have lots of minor things also, right? And uh, if you like this video, please. Uh, do not forget to subscribe my channel, hit the like button, 
uh, comment and subscribe and support me by these things thank you so much for watching this video